Hey guys, all right, so it's all over the news that NVIDIA is basically released dedicated crypto mining cards and that they're nerfing the 3060 specifically through software. So what's this all about? So it, it, it's really, it, to me, it's about NVIDIA asserting their control over their market position and trying to spread what they think is goodwill to the gamer community. So let me explain. So in the gamer community, it really has been up in arms about how mining companies are snatching up all the profitable 30X GPUs because of their profitability in mining cryptocurrencies, mainly Ethereum. There are others like Ravencoin and Zill and others, but mainly Ethereum. So what this announcement is really all about, in my opinion, is optics. NVIDIA wants to keep gamers and the gamer press in particular happy and to continue to build goodwill with them. And this announcement of the CPM card is designed to release some of the air out of gamers' frustration with GPU shortages. But don't kid yourself. They really don't care who buys their GPUs, right? They love having back orders, whether it's Chinese mining companies or someone playing Fortnite. They really don't care who buys their cards. Now, regarding the nerfing of the 3060, in my opinion, it's, it's really an awful move uh, on their part. So offer control over what uh, what a customer can do with their purchase, I, th I don't think is ever really a good idea. If I spend $350 on a graphics card, I want to do with it whatever I want to do with it. So am I going to buy a 3060 if I want to mine at night when I'm not playing? No, no way. I think NVIDIA missed that most gamers are pretty tech savvy and many have or are dipping their toe into part-time mining to reap back some of what they spent on their GPUs. And this will not be possible with the 3060, so why would I buy it? You know, the 3060 might as well have a big red tag on it saying, nerfed, you cannot mine with this card. So other cards, in particular the 3060 Ti, they're going to still be attractive to miners, you know, because of their hash rates, even with these new CPM cards. Check out this, um, this article in uh, anadtech.com. They did a really great comparison of hash rates here. So here's a new CPM HX cards, right? So let's take, for example, the 40 HX, right? The middle of the road card, 36 mega hash for, ETH, for Ethereum which is roughly around what a 1080 Ti can do. This basically is what a 1080 Ti can do, okay? And if you compare that with what the current cards can do, look, for example, let's take a look at the 3060 Ti, which is what? Is it $400? 60 mega hash at 120 watts. So the efficiency, the power efficiency is phenomenal on this card. Obviously, this is a sweet spot card for most people that are mining and you know they really say it straight here where they say the only way these new cpm hx cards will make financial sense is if they're really cheap and also if they're really efficient for cooling i would add or space so if, for example if you can put you know 18 cpm cards in the same space that you would put 10 30 60 ti's then it probably would make sense to do that and that I'm sure that NVIDIA is pretty smart. They're not going to price these so that people aren't going to buy them. But still, if you take a look at this, there's no reason why I don't think people will still be clamoring to buy a 3060 Ti to mine with it, right? Now, are they going to nerf the cards that they've already shipped, the 30X cards that they've already shipped? I, I think that's doubtful because this will cause a major furious uproar amongst miners and gamers slash miners which is basically their customer base right so now if nvidia had announced this new cpm card alone without announcing the nerfing of the 3060 i wouldn't be making this video right it's really the nerfing of the 3060 that has raised the concerns of everyone especially the possibility of them releasing a driver that nerfs the 30x cards down the road like the 30 3090 3080 etc people that have already spent money on those and I know a lot of gamers that have told me that they've purchased a 30X GPU and they're mining with it and they've made back a decent amount of money toward the cost of that card. So, but again, I doubt that that's going to happen. You know, millions of dollars have been spent on these other 30X cards 
for them to basically nerf all those cards, it would cause a serious uproar in the market. So I doubt that that's going to happen. But in any event, that's my opinion. This is basically something to pacify, if you will, the gamer community. But I think the gamer community is a lot smarter than that, and they realize really what it is, right? So anyway, you guys may disagree with me. If you do, would love to hear about it in the comments and your opinion on this release. Hit that like button if you like what you saw. Don't forget to subscribe to the channel for more gaming, GPU, and technology discussion. Thanks, guys, and have a great day.